I'm about to uh, show you guys how to repair your drift car bumpers. First, all you need is this resin and the hardener that comes with it. So it comes on top, but you could buy uh, the hardener separate. Uh, and then you need some acetone, some sandpapers, like a DA and stuff. You know, I have all that stuff over there. So I sanded all of this, prepped it, cleaned it with acetone, and now these are the areas that need to be repaired. They're all clean. This, this is like shit, but it's all clean. It's like, it, like this I caught on fire. So it just looks like crap. Then you wanna have a bunch of these ready, cut to probably what you already need. But one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So that's what I'm gonna be repairing. So I better have 11 of those. I'm gonna get fucked. So first, you're gonna take the hardener, pour the amount you need in here. One, there's some big ass bottle ones. I think I'm gonna need more than this. It's probably really not good to mix more than this, honestly, because this is the first layer and that shit's gonna harden pretty fast. So I'm just gonna use that for now and make it work, at least get everything held together. Either way, you know, you have to fill the whole top of hardener like that. As long as it's almost covering the whole thing, it should be good enough. Now I take the mixing stick. Doing everything with one hand, and I start mixing. And then usually once I get it a little bit, I throw a little bit more hardener in there. brush put it on all the areas that you need the fiberglass to go on that way it sticks when you lay down the sheet don't be afraid to put a shitload of Just like that, that just done. Okay, I'm gonna get this one. Same with these holes too. Like basically the same shit. Should probably have something on the other side, but I don't care about the storage floor, so let me show you how to do the holes. So, bam, 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 ready? So I'm gonna take a big ass patch on it'll start laying down i need to just start pouring it on work this shit down there yes everything off it started drying up on me right here it started turning like jelly so but i got it to lay down luckily seems like once you start getting down low to the thing uh in the resin in the cup once it gets low it starts to dry fast all right that's just how long it takes to dry usually you got about 10 or 15 minutes but the only thing i didn't get was this hole which is probably gonna get a metal washer in it and that 
but I could probably just notch the other side out to match that perfect. That's probably what's gonna happen there. So we'll see what happens. Maybe I could do metal things right here too. Woo -hoo.